This is going to be a video tutorial on how to run Windows System File Checker using the command prompt in Windows 11. Let me jump over to my desktop here. I am on my desktop now. To check your system's files for corruption, it's very easy to do. First thing you want to do is open command prompt in administrator mode. I'm going to go down to the taskbar down here at the bottom. I'm going to place my mouse cursor in the little search box. I'm going to type in CMD. I'm going to go up to where it says command prompt. I'm going to right click. I'm going to click on run as administrator. It'll ask me do I want to allow this app to make changes to the device. I'm going to click on yes. Now, command prompt has opened in administrator mode. Next thing you want to do is paste in this command right here. I will place this command down in the uh, description of the video. Uh, capital SFC forward slash scan now. Hit enter. And this will take it a little while. It's going to go all through your system files. It's going to compare them to a cached version of the system files within your computer and it will automatically fix them. If it doesn't automatically fix them I'll show you another remedy. Okay it has finished scanning my system files and it says it did not find any integrity violations, no errors, no corruption. If it does find any errors it'll probably have you reboot and after you reboot I would repeat this process with this command right up here sfc forward slash scan now just to make sure that there are no more errors. If it's still giving you errors, if you still have corruption with your system files, I'll give you another command that you could paste in. That would be this command right here, capital D-I-S-M space forward slash capital O online space forward slash cleanup image space forward slash restore health. Hit enter. And what this does is it checks your uh, your cached system files to check to see if they're actually corrupted. And as you can see, it will take a little time to get through that. It has completed. It says the restore operation completed successfully. The operation completed successfully. Now you want to do the first step again. The SFC forward slash scan now. Hit enter. And it will, once again, this, this might fix, fix your problem. And that is how to run Windows System File Checker using Command Prompt. Thanks for watching.